Okay, so these next few mnemonics are going to help you, be, uh, or to help you remember the heart sound. So there's, um, this can be, this is a little bit of a longer one, guys. So the mnemonics, there's a couple mnemonics, and the heart sounds, so they're aortic, pulmonic, herbs point, tricuspid, and mitral. So some of the mnemonics are ape to man, A-P-E, then T to man, and ape to man. Uh, a couple others, All People Enjoy Time Magazine or Apple Pie, especially taste mmm. <laughs> so A-P-E-T-M, All People Enjoy Time Magazine, Apple Pie, especially taste mmm, and ape to man, A-P-E-T for the two M man. So again, the sounds are aortic and pulmo- pulmonic, herbs point, tricuspid, and mitral. So just so you know what each of these are. So aortic and pulmonic. So if you think about it, where they're located, two words and two spaces. So these coincide because they're both in the second intercostal space. A is immediately to the right of the sternum and P is immediately to the left of the sternum. And then we've got herbs point. Herb has three letters. So you can find it on the third intercostal space just to the left of the sternum. And it's also the third one you auscultate. So the aortic, pulmonic, and then herbs point. And then tricuspid is at the fifth intercostal space just to, space, just to the left of the sternum. So tri equals three. Okay, so this is a little confusing, but bear with me here. So tricuspid, tri equals three. Then this is the fourth place to auscultate in the fifth intercostal space, so three, four, five. And then the last one, mitral, mit sounds similar to mid, so the mid clavicular area and straight down to the nipple, straight down to below the nipple line, so you get to that middle, mid clavicular, middle of the clavicle, um, draw a line straight below, right below where the nipple line is, and where the nipple should be, not where it technically actually is, because some people's nipple lines can be way lower (laughs) than this point needs to be. So keep that in mind. Um, So those are all your heart sounds. So aortic, pulmonic, herbs point, tricuspid, mitral, ape to man, all people enjoy Time Magazine, or apple pie tastes mmm. Or, excuse me, apple pie especially tastes mmm. And there's um, another way to kind of help you remember, because if you have an S3 and S4, those can indicate problems. And to remember what problems they can indicate, so S3 has three syllables, so heart failure. And S4 has four syllables, hypertension. Hypertension. So that's another way to remember Uh, what these additional heart sounds can indicate. So S3 is three syllables, heart failure, and S4 is four syllables, hypertension. This has been another episode of the Nursing Mnemonics Podcast by NRSNG.com with your host, Katie Kleber, RN, CCRN. To grab all of our nursing cheat sheets, head over to NRSNG.com slash freebies. That's NRSNG.com slash freebies. Thank you so much for being here today. We love you guys. We thank you so much. We want to see you guys succeed. Listen, we're all in this together. Now go out and be your best self today. Happy nursing.